Many things change. In the time of Jonathan, when you come to toilet in places like ShopRite, this is the kind of tissue they give you. Because when they give you this kind of tissue, you play with it, you lay foundation, you clean the mouth of the toilet because of some men who are not focused. Why are you relating? But first then, no. Buhari, tissue change shape. As he be now, my people, when you come to the toilet, As you are coming, they tell him, welcome. They give you tissue according to your size. If you fat, they fold it three times. One. <laughs> three. The one will shock me past. Now when I come, the guy give me one lip. I say, bros, I know one blonde nose. <laughs> Things have changed. That is why you see in 2023, please. Please, I don't know. No. Today I look at given two thousand, which can no, should not make mistake. That is why somebody like Peter Obi, I'm not saying it because I'm an evil man. Peter Obi will make Nigeria great. The man can save. I went to perform for Peter Obi when he was a governor in Anambra State. Yeah, my friend, we did very well. He called his PA. PA, yeah. Find this boy something. In our mind, your excellency wants to give you something. PA gave us 10,000. We call the verse. Ah, your excellency says you should give us so you are giving us 10,000. Peter will be here again. PA, Bia, how much did you give them? 10,000. Give them 1,000. Let them go and find change. 5,500. Are you giving them 10,000? How much is my chief of staff earning? Peter B was driving in Anambra State. The governor threw something from the window. He came back and picked it. They called the interview and said, Your Excellency, this is a sign of leadership. He said, No. I was trying to recharge my MTN 1.5. And mistakenly, I did not know it did not enter. My sister had to pick it. Do you know with 1,000, you can change Bangladesh? <laughs> Soludo came into power. Soludo. I bet I'm going to remove this thing. You know. I fought people. I fought. I fought. Yes. Not a video meal. <laughs> Came into power. And they said, we are going to stop sit at home. The next Monday, the sit at home tick. Three weeks later, some people came to government house to see me. As soon as you are in the office, he said, don't you know that today you sit at home? Please, where is, is Felado Rotoye coming out? My brother, you see what he see for 219. No? They do president in Lagos. He speak English. We're going to change Nigeria. When in come Aba, they speak English. Nigeria need a quantum leader. Those Aba boys come. Hey, yeah, he man can rise. He begin to can rise. He need, he can only hear in hand. Please, I'm here to consult. Make could do like say I can't consult. Anyway, I'm running for the post of the deputy governor of Enugu State. Yes, him is also, but second tenor, you'll be my deputy. If you notice, there is no party now because our governor have not decided. I'm very optimistic they are going to choose us. But in case. In case, I beg you, any party where they look for a candidate for East, I make myself available. <laughs> Man of God, I celebrate you. I tap into your anointing. Hi, daddy. Children, no get respect again. No? Did they insult men of God on social media? A whole daddy G.O. Papa Depoye. As big as he is. You know, one day I was driving, I saw Redeemed Christian Church of God, House on the Rock Parish. Thank you, the insult. Do, do you know that? No. Come to think about it. They're insulting men of God, insulting men of God. 
If Jesus was in this generation, do you know what Jesus did? Come wedding. The chairman, the governor of Portacourt, Wike. They say, man of God, wine don't finish. He say, bring water and put it into the scan. Go and give it to the chairman. Wike, they go give chairman. Jesus. Man of Don't imagine now your pastor saying, you say, go cause charis. Go bring the newest car where nobody drive. Imagine say Jesus day now. <laughs> sir, you know you people are not endangered species. <laughs> but sir, the way you... you know, all things through Christ, the strength in you. Please, a round of applause for my friend's wife, Sister Vicky. Sister Vicky, stand up now. Uh -uh. Ah, this lady, try you. Please, let's celebrate this woman. You know, the title of this show is Change World. Things don't change. Everything don't change. But say fine. Last three weeks, we were talking about emotion. I'll be violent. But women were going through a lot of violence, sexual violence. My wife, is any day I want to play in the night. Now my wife, they remember to they send me a message. Oh, stop playing, baby, baby, baby. Babe, go and check if the children are not sleeping well. <laughs> you come back. Baby, they have slept well. We we'll play, play, play. Babe, are you sure the front door is closed? <laughs> I will go close the door, come back. We we'll play, 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 play. Baby, are you sure that fan is off? <laughs> I will come back. We men. My wife said, babe, your hand is too hot. I go put my hand for fridge. <laughs> when I came back, my wife was sleeping. I said, wake up. You know the first thing they'll say, can't somebody play with you? Am I your playmate? <laughs> Man and woman, they play. But our parents, you never see our parents when they love love, but they, they born us nine. In one room, how did they do them? One day I was playing with my wife just to appease the gods. I didn't know when I asked her, uh, that your father's house, how much? I'll complete it. She said 10 million. I said, all right, all right, all right. Two days later, I came. I saw one man in my parlor. I said, who is this? He said, Engineer Tony. I said, who is Engineer Tony? He said, the guy that will... I told my wife I was under duress. There was an influence on me. What is all this? My, my, they say my time don't work. But I want to crack this last joke because it don't, they, it don't they spread. Now me get the joke. I'm new in Lagos. I'm looking for a mentor. They say before you blow in Lagos, you have to have a man. Our parents did not suffer. Give birth to children. They will call ourselves on the village. Very loyal women. They will stay in our homes 20 years. But now, those women know they, they call them nanny. They work with agency. They even give them targets. Stay in this house one month and five days. Your nanny will travel during December and not come. Any day they say, I'm going for December. My procedure tell them bye bye. I change six nannies in one month. But see, fine. My first nanny, any day I come home, she'll speak one English. Welcome, daddies. <laughs> I said, this girl, they call me daddies. If you are speaking this wrong English, my friend, what will happen? I told my wife, no, 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 because the kind of children will be grown now. No. We brought another, my wife gave her an issue. She said, anything I buy from the market, put it in the fridge. My wife went to the market, you know, women bought so many things. Me, I say, man, I go buy for it, come watch book. By the time I opened my fridge, I saw detergent, I saw pampas, I saw my wife's with one, even the foil. I said, no, this one need to do what? No. We brought another one. I did not know we were living with a mad woman. Her strength. She will clean my house, clean my neighbor's house, sweep our street. <laughs> Three o'clock in the morning, you should know. I, I, I. Who are you? Auntie Amoa. Have you cleaned the room? Yes, ma'am. Have you cleaned the parlor? Yes, ma'am. What is the man? He said, just to bath you and organ. <laughs> when I heard that one, my nanny to bet me and my wife. I said, no, this one need to do what? 
I went and brought another nanny, 12 years old. That one was drinking my son's milk. I was giving my son Eba. <laughs> Finally, I called my wife. I said, I am tired of this young girl that will need a mature nanny. Somebody say mature nanny. I went and brought a 65-year-old nanny, mama. Pastor Fire, I became an errand boy in my house. <laughs> my nanny will call me, my son, give me water. Oh. <laughs> Don't give me cold one, no. I came home, I saw my wife washing plates in the kitchen. I said, what happened? He said, mama, say anybody that eats in this house was most plate. <laughs> one day they took light. My nanny naked into the door. What a killer, hey man, your jail. I was in the parlor watching a movie with my wife around nine. Nanny came into the parlor. He said, go and sleep tomorrow is school. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Frank.